Hello students, uh, my name is Monoranjan Dora from Mechatronics and Robotics Lab, Department of Mechanical Engineering, IIT Guwahati. Today I am going to explain you about the TRMS system, part of Data Acquisition Lab. So in TRMS system, we have actually two rotors. So this is the rotor number one. Next is rotor number two. Okay, so these are this TRMS full form is twin motor MIMO system. Okay, twin motor means two motors are there, motor one and motor two. MIMO means multi input and multi output. Okay, so what are the inputs are there and what are the outputs are there in this system? Inputs are giving we are giving say motor 1 we are giving some voltage v1 okay. for motor 2 we are giving some voltage v2 okay so these are the input two voltage we are giving to two rotors okay then outputs are in this system there are two encoders this is encoder number one say e1 and another is here encoder e2 okay so e1 encoder e1 for this pitch rotor okay pitch rotor and encoder e2 this e2 So uh, encoder E2, this E2 for your rotor, your, okay. So this fan is your. So we can with this encoder E1 and E2, E1 and E2, E1 and E2. we can measure the angles from e1 we can measure the pitch this pitch angle pitch angle means this vertical angle and from e2 we can measure the horizontal axis angle of your this your fan okay so in this experiment all these data v1 and v2 voltage provided to the rotor okay then e1 and e2 encoder values all you can collect in this pc okay so in this pc we have matlab software okay we have matlab software MATLAB software. Okay. In that MATLAB so software, uh, it has also one part of uh, one addition software is installed with this MATLAB. But after uh, after running this software, you can go to MATLAB, Simulink, and from there you can make the control models okay so i am going to show you how it will be look like okay from start menu you can get open the feedback twin motor memo system app it will be uh, connected with matlab software then it will take some time depending upon your pc ram and it will pop up okay it will take some time so finally we get like this 
okay after that you will get this window okay so this window you can you are, you are get getting now this window you can get so here two blocks are there one for trms simulation model one for trms real time model so what is trms simulation model and what is uh, trms real time model in simulation you can design some algorithm to control these two rotors and you can you can test there that whether your particular trajectory follow or not you can install some controller there virtual controller like pid controller you can install and change the pid value and if it is followed your trajectory then same value you can provide to the trms real time model from real time model you can run the real rotor fans from simulation you you just ab able to see whether your control algorithm are working properly or not okay one more thing i want to uh, explain you that is So this this is the uh, model of uh, two rotors. The first is this is uh, pitch, and this is yaw. Okay, yaw, and this is pitch. This complete system is uh, you can study with this. Twin rotor MIMO system is a replicate replicating of helicopter model, but in real helicopter, this blade angle, fa, uh, rotor blade angle, say theta, theta you can change in real, real helicopter, okay? But in our model, the blade angles are fixed, okay? And other thing you can compare with the real helicopter so from this model you can you can able to develop some algorithm and get knowledge how real helicopter will control and how we can develop to control algorithm and make it stabilize okay because this is non linear system you need to use some control system control develop some control algorithm and accordingly try to control it by balance flight okay say your angle you can change pitch angle you can change or you can using by both fan you you can uh, you can stop at a particular altitude okay now i think this will be sufficient for your introduction part